Hi, my name is Chris Dysart. I am a motor vehicle accident attorney. On June 26, 2009, an Associated Wholesale Grocers truck slammed into vehicles stopped on Highway 44 near Miami, Oklahoma. As a result of that collision, 10 people died and five other people were seriously injured. In other videos, we have discussed this tragic case and we discussed what the subsequent investigation showed caused the accident, namely truck driver fatigue. In this video, I want to turn our attention to why in this case and in many cases, preventing truck driver fatigue is the trucking company's responsibility. In this case, the trucking company did not have an appropriate fatigue management program in place at the time of the collision. Federal regulations require trucking companies to take reasonable steps to prevent drivers from driving when they're fatigued. For instance, 49 CFR section 392.3 specifically provides that a motor carrier, sh carrier shall not permit a driver to operate a commercial motor vehicle while the driver's ability or alertness is so impaired or likely to become impaired through fatigue to make it unsafe to operate the vehicle. What should a trucking company's fatigue management system include? It should include the following. A driver education program concerning fatigue. Scheduling truck driver runs to prevent fatigue. Medical screening for health issues that cause fatigue like sleep apnea. Teaching truck drivers to get adequate rest when they're off duty. And an overall strategy to ensure a fatigue management system is followed by the company's truck drivers. In the Miami, Oklahoma case, the subsequent investigation showed that the company failed to implement an effective fatigue management program. In fact, the company's fatigue management program consisted of providing its drivers with an outdated and misleading videotape and pamphlet. The video provided improper strategies for fighting fatigue, such as chewing gum, turning on the radio, and rolling down the window. In fact, the investigation at the, the collision showed that the truck driver's window was rolled down. The Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration has discouraged the use of such alertness tricks by drivers because they don't work and they provide drivers with a false sense of security. The investigation that followed this tragic collision showed that the trucking company had taken no realistic steps to reduce truck driver fatigue. Truck driver fatigue is a leading cause of truck accidents. By some estimates, as many as 60% of truck accidents are caused by driver fatigue. For these reasons, driver fatigue should be suspected and investigated in every collision involving a tractor trailer or big rig. If you or someone you care about has been involved in an accident involving an 18-wheeler or a big rig, please call my toll-free number, 888 586-7041. We can talk about your case and I can answer any questions that you may have. There will be no fee unless we win your case. I also invite you to view our other educational truck accident videos and car accident videos on this site. Thank you.